all of this, and there are methods for doing that. So please, all photographers, go a bit more in the back. So that okay, thank you for joining us. Tell me, um, what, 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 why are these sorts of events so important? I think it gives us a chance to meet other transport ministers from across the world and you, you get the chance to listen to what's happening in their countries, to some of the problems they're facing and sometimes uh, they, can be, they can be facing problems which you face as a country. So there's all that exchange of information which comes across very well. We had a very interesting uh, conversation yesterday afternoon about aviation capacity and how you build sort of new runways and the difficulties that that can sometimes provide, particularly if it's in urban areas. So that's a particular area that the United Kingdom is at the moment uh, looking at the old issue of aviation capacity. So these are very, very important opportunities. So it's a learning and sharing experience then? It's a learning and sharing and also gaining information. You know, there's, uh, transport is vital to today's economy. It's vital to uh, today's world. You know, if, if, if transport slows, everything slows. So um, getting it right uh, is, is good. So for the British delegation, what were you hoping, what will you take away from this? What, what were you hoping to achieve here? Well, I've, uh, I've had a number of European bilaterals while I've been here, so meeting the French minister, the German minister, but also other ministers too, uh, talking to the Turkey, Turkish minister, Qatar uh, minister. So there's been a lot of uh, sort of government-to-government -government, uh, meetings.